today um, just because life happens and whatnot. Um, but this is a beer out of Red Cypress Brewing down in Florida. Unfortunately, they closed about 10 days ago. They closed on May 31st, um, which is kind of sad. But you know what happens, I guess. Um, I haven't had anything by them, but I've heard nothing but amazing things. Um, Larry, my buddy Larry gave me this when I was down in North Carolina last. This is Imperial Cookie Death Roll. This is their... Um, this is a imperial stout, obviously, with uh, milk stout with lactose, oats, chocolate, and other spices. Um, he also gave me a k- bottle of their kitchen sink, which is essentially that with coconut chilies, coffee, and bur- bourbon barrel aged. And uh, I've heard nothing but great things from those guys, so it's kind of sad to see them go. I haven't had them before, so well, I guess let's find out if they're actually good or not right now. No, um, it, it's always sad to to see a, um, a a brewery have to close its doors. So, and I appreciate the 12 ounce cans. These are really nice. I think this comes in at 9.7% ABV. I don't think it's on the can. I looked it up right before I uh, uh, took this out of the fridge and then forgot to look at it while I was letting it warm up. Um, have it in our Hardywood um, glassware. Well, I have a lot of fingerprints on there. I guess I've been using this today. A good one finger ahead. Um, pretty much pitch black, even in the light. Yeah, it looks pretty much on camera like what it looks like to me right now. Um, let's get a nose. It smells, mm, well, smell-wise, it may be a little, I'm just cutting up garlic, so this is probably not good to be cutting my hands over this. I'm getting a roasted chocolatey, roasty chocolate, and batter, doughiness. like sweetness, like, yeah, I think the, that, if that's, if that's like an oatmeal cookie... Yeah, more like a cinnamony, but not like cinnamon you would expect in like a horchata stout or like a chili stout or anything like that. Like it's like chocolatey sweet. Like if you had a chocolate oatmeal cookie, it's gonna taste. Cheers. Well. For one, I will say that sucks that they're closing because this beer is delicious. There's chocolate, there's raisin, there's a little bit of the cinnamon, there's the spices. Um, It's sweet, but it's not overly sweet. It's got a little bit of roastiness. It ends on the back palate with this like little bit of roasty bitterness. But the initial sip, the mouthfeel is heavenly. It is creamy, and it's almost like it literally leaves this like sugary sweetness dancing on your tongue as it's balancing out in the back and getting that. I mean, as it's bittering out in the back. Um, this is a phenomenal beer. Holy shit! There's just so much going on, but it's all. Well balanced. I know we've all our all us beer tubers have been making jokes lately that oh well balanced. But no, it is nothing is overpowering. The roast comes through very nicely at the end in the bitterness and it just kind of the end and the but you get this like sugary sweetness like an oatmeal cookie. If you eat an oatmeal cookie, you get that um I guess it depends what kind of oatmeal cookie. Is it chocolate oatmeal? Is it chocolate and raisins? I get like a little bit of that like dark fruitiness. Um and it just kind of goes into this sugary sweetness, doughy, chocolatey, delicious, creamy, creamy stout. And it's a shame that I only have one can of this. Um, but wow, this beer is absolutely delicious. So if you guys can still get your hands on some Red Cypress, I imagine, I know they close. I imagine there's obviously still some stuff left. Um, I know they're waiting to like kind of kill all their kegs. Um, maybe they'll come back. Who knows? Um, we've, we've seen crazier, right? Um, Pretty Things is back in London, so and that's that's a thing. Um, but anyways, yeah, let me know in the comments if you've had anything from Red Cypress. If you've had Imperial um, Oatmeal Cookie Death Roll. They've also had their kitchen sink, which um, I'm going to be trying very soon. That has coffee in it. Probably should have did this opposite and actually had Mike drink this with me and uh, do the coffee one solo, but the coffee one's a bigger bottle, like that size, um, so I didn't really want to do that. But anyways, whatever. I digress. Um, there's says on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, those are your things. Don't forget to hit the like, comment, subscribe button, the little, little notification button, and uh, I'm Sean. This is Nerd Sense. Cheers. Cheers.